Uh, hey, excuse me. Yes, you, the one reading this post. I hope you're safe, both physically and mentally. And if not, I hope you have people you can go to that you do feel safe with. Thank you, Snob. I've been calling my mom girl boss, and she either hasn't noticed or she just accepted that I'm a menace to society. Apple bottom beans. This is a 50k post to me. Don't kill me, please. Yo, can you believe no one had this URL? Oh my god. I love Butterfly Race because half the images of them online comes in two varieties and it's a baby or I know what you are. I consider myself a micro-influencer and the way that I can get 10 to 15 people to consume a piece of media if I'm annoying enough about it. The other day my math teacher was checking my homework and after he was done he said, Bazinga! and walked away. And it hit me with such whiplash that I almost got up and walked out of the classroom. Things you can say in response to literally anything when you have nothing else to say. As the prophecy foretold, but at what cost? So let it be written, so let it be done. So, it has come to this. That's just what he, she, they would have said. Is this why fate brought us together? And thus, I die. Just like in my dream. Be that as it may, still may it be as it may be. There is no escape from destiny. Wise words by wise men write wise deeds and wise pen. In this economy. And then the wolves came. I personally like the last two. A guy walks in with two puncture wounds on his neck like, you should sue the other guy. And then a vampire walks in covered in those cartoony lipstick marks. So I'm going to write this. I've been carrying around this cursed grimoire all day and no one's asked me about it. <laughs> two dudes chilling in open graves five feet apart because they're not gay. This is actually an art piece by Miller and Shellabarger where they dug graves connected by a tunnel so they could hold hands. They're very much gay and IRL married. I will continue posting in big text and cannot be stopped. Lemon lime toilet. I'm afraid you're gonna have to stop. Yes, I am a triple threat. Mommy issues, daddy issues, issues. Shout out to Cheesecake and Cheese Cube, the only dogs near me that have a name including Cheese. I hope you find loving homes, but I'm just a lonely college student without the ability to get a dog looking at Pet Finder to find joy in exam season. And the impulsivity demons made me look up Cheese. I better get a follow-up story that these two got adopted and are in good homes, please. Be me, late at night, craving a Wendy's burger. Not even hungry, I know I'll only take a few bites and throw the rest away. I like the idea of eating a Wendy's burger, but not so much the reality of paying for something I won't eat. Decide to picture the burger instead. Vividly picture platonic form of Wendy's burger. It's perfect. They can't possibly fuck up the order because it's in my mind. I imagine eating the burger bite by bite. I finish. Feel better. No more craving. What the fuck is wrong with me? Capitalism zero, burger topo one. The cha-cha slide in full metal armor. Slide to the left. One hop this time. Two hops this time. Everybody clap your hands. 